For your viewfinder, we're going to make a three inch by four inch hole. So please get a nice thick paper. And if that means that you use a really nice piece of drawing paper that I gave you because that's the thickest paper you have, then absolutely you go ahead and use that. I have a nine by 12 inch piece of paper here. I'm going to rip that in half or cut that in half so I don't have to deal with the entire size of it. So six about here. So I want it to be, you know, well, I'll go slightly off center and a um, little art teacher rip. I'm just going to pull this up with one hand while I push down with the other. And I've got my little rip. And now get rid of that side. I'm going to keep the one that's just slightly bigger. You see how I ripped them a little bit uneven. And I'm going to make a three inch by four inch hole on here. So if I want to make my four inch hole this way, it does not have to be in the exact center. I can say, I can put a dot at three inches and seven inches because that's four inches in between. And slide my ruler down and do it again. Three inches and seven inches. And just because it's always good to measure three times and make sure they're all lined up, you can find out if you have any mistakes. Okay, so now this was the three inch line, this was the seven inch line, and that means they are four inches apart from each other. Now I'm going to do the same thing in the other direction, except I only want them to be three inches apart from each other. So I will put a dot at two and five, slide it down, two and five, slide it down, connect them. As you can tell, I am not being careful about the overlaps and the lines and all of those things. It doesn't matter. What matters is that I have a three inch space by a four inch space. And I am going to cut this part out. Okay. So I'm going to cut right out to the corners. something. Notice I overcut the corner. That allows me to get my scissors into here and quite honestly it's not going to matter when we're done. So it's okay if you need to cut past the corner to get a nice clean straight cut then please do that. So this is overcut. There we go. And now I have a four inch by three inch hole. And I have a nice clean perfect side and I can use my viewfinder vertically, I can use it horizontally, it does not matter if this space is bigger than this space or smaller, I am using this just for the proportions of the hole.